Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the blue screen of that error 0x00000154 on Windows 11 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to reinstall or update your drivers. Now to do this right click on your Windows button and select device manager from the list of options. And in here in the device manager window make sure to locate any problematic device and drivers. For example let's do the display adapters. So expand it, right click on the problematic device and select the uninstall device option. Now tick the box next to attempt to remove the driver for this device and confirm once again by clicking on the uninstall button. Afterwards you'll see that after you restart your computer, these drivers will be automatically reinstalled on your PC. And you can check if the problem still persists, but you can also update the drivers on your PC. In order to do this, right click the problematic device and select the update driver option. Now click on search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best available drivers already on your PC. Now once your drivers are updated, close these windows, restart your computer and then check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to use the Windows 11's built-in troubleshooter. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and make sure to click on system on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and click on it. Now select other troubleshooters and then make sure to click on the run button next to the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Windows will now try to detect any problems and fix them as soon as possible. And then you can simply restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Next, another useful solution is to boot into your system through the safe mode. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and then make sure to click on system on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the recovery section and click on it. Now in here under recovery options, you have an option that says advanced startup. So make sure to click on the restart now button next to it and now you will be taken to the advanced startup menu. In here, just make sure to choose the troubleshoot category and afterwards go to advanced options and then select startup settings. Now in here, make sure to click on the restart button and press on 4 or F4 on your keyboard to start safe mode with networking. From here on, you can check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to run the SFC and DISM scans. Now to do this, press the Windows button, type in CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. In here, make sure to input the following commands, but press enter after each command is finished. Note that these scans can take a bit of time, so don't lose patience. Just relax, wait until they're finished, and then you can close this window, restart your computer and check if the issue still persists. And lastly, another useful solution is to simply reset Windows. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon, then make sure to click on system on the left pane, and afterwards on the right side, scroll down until you find the recovery section and just click on it. Now in here you have an option under recovery options that says reset this PC. Make sure to click on the reset PC button next to it. From here on just follow the on-screen instructions, choose your preferences for this procedure and then wait until everything will be reset. And afterwards you'll check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it. Super simple, isn't it? Of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thank you.